Love is in the air and so is Oscar season. What's up everyone? I'm Ashley Bornanson with the Red Carpet Report and today we're kicking back at Fig and Olive at Doris Bergman's Oscar Valentine Lounge where celebs are getting the sweetest swag for their Valentines. All right, Christian, how are you doing today? I'm doing wonderful, thank you. <laughs> and what's it like to be here at the Doris Bergman's Oscar Lounge? Well, I've only just gotten here, but so far everyone's treated me really nice. It's yeah. beautiful, beautiful today. Definitely, definitely preparing for Valentine's Day. Do you yes. have any plans tomorrow? Actually, my husband has to work tomorrow, so oh. it's going to be my daughter and myself having a really? sweet little day. Yeah. Oh my gosh, you look so young. <laughs> well, thank you. <laughs> I won't tell you how old she is then. <laughs> really? I was like, she's like 20. <laughs> yes, we'll go with that. <laughs> I love it. Okay, and you're part of Bounty Killer, which is big huge call right now what kind of fan reaction are you getting uh, a lot we have such an incredible fan base anyway all the comic type you know movie fans are just um, they're really wonderful they're really dedicated and um, super excited about everything we do so it's, yeah. it's cool to have them on board it's a different different breed of people but they're just so cool to have as fans really? yeah what kind of reaction did you get from comic-con uh, Comic-Con, you know, we didn't get to go this past year. I was in, in Canada. I was in um, Montreal at that time. So, oh, wow. I know, but we were here, we were there the three years before that with just little snippets of things. And they yeah. were, like I said, like they're just so excited about anything awesome that you do. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, they were really excited about it. Wow, <laughs> definitely. And with Oscars just around the corner, are there any, is there anyone you're rooting for this Oscar season? Oh gosh, I'm rooting for everyone. I've loved so many movies that I've watched this year. Um, definitely, of course, the American Hustle people and, you know, just I, I, all of them. All of them have been so great. I haven't been disappointed with one movie yet. Really? No. Did you see any of the other ones, like Frozen or? Oh my goodness. I have to admit, I have not seen Frozen yet, but my daughter has. And I know every single word to every single song in the movie, even though I haven't seen it. I've seen probably little snippets of the entire thing because my daughter's YouTubing it all the time. But oh, really? what a wonderful, wonderful movie. I just yeah. know I'm going to love it. I know it's one of those uh, classic Disney movies that you know they put out every now and then. It's, it's a good one. You're in such great shape. You are seriously so beautiful. You're radiating. Do you have any like fitness tips for those, especially since we're coming into the new year? Don't stop moving. Here's what I figured out. I used to be able to just wait until the week before and whip into shape really fast, and I'm learning now I have to maintain. Okay. So um, I've been doing a lot of running. I do a lot of hiking. I do some mixed martial arts, um, which is really fun if you want to ever try it because it's really? not only do you get a good workout, but you also uh, get to relieve some stress and yeah. you know wail on a punching bag first thing in the morning, and you will not have road rage during the day, I promise. I promise you. Is that the key to LA road rage? Yes, yes. Get up, hit something a couple times, something that should be hit. Wow. <laughs> what does your daughter think of mommy being on TV? And oh, she loves it. She really loves it. And she loves the character that I was playing and the type of um, like stunts and things that I was doing. So she decided, I told her, I was like, you can take anything. You can do dance, you can do drama, like anything you want to do. And she said, I want to take martial arts because I'm going to be baby Mary Death someday. <laughs> All right, that. take martial arts then, kid. That's fantastic. Do you, what is your next project that you want to be working on? Uh, just something probably in a similar vein. So far, um, all of the offers that are coming are very similar, uh, doing a lot of stunts, a lot of action. Um, I'm totally digging it right now. I mean, really? I'm young enough to do it, you know, yeah. and I'm just really excited about it at the moment. So yeah. You're like a young Angelina Jolie. Well, thank you. Like, like, you can quote her on that. <laughs> beautiful, action-packed, female. Now, do you do a lot of your own stunts? Yes, I did almost all of my own stunts on the last film, and um, you know, hopefully the next one they'll let me do all of them. <laughs> okay, wow. Would you ever take on something completely opposite, like romantic comedy? Absolutely. Or yeah, absolutely. Okay. In fact, I started out doing um, kind of you know comedy, drama, a lot of drama, and I thought that I would stick with that all along until this came up, and I just tried it and loved it, and realized. Uh, there's a whole level of acting that I never thought about with when you add the action to it. You know, it's just an adrenaline-packed, a magnificent day on set. It's just so much fun. We shot our last movie in 18 days, so it was like going to Disneyland every single day. Um, but at the end of it, you were just kind of like, oh my God, what just happened? Yeah. <laughs> what do you do to keep up your energy, especially while filming? 
It's just adrenaline. I mean, especially when you're doing fight sequences all day long, um, it just keeps you going until you don't have to go anymore. And then the next morning, you're so excited to get started that, again, your adrenaline pump pumps in, you know, and it's just, uh, it's really good. It also keeps you from feeling the pain when you're getting hurt during the day. Oh, yeah. Are you getting hurt? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> there's no way. If anyone tells you they've done an entire action movie and never got hurt, there's no way. <laughs> Gosh. What kind of advice would you want to give to those budding actresses that want to be just like you, especially in the action-packed kind of film? Um, just keep it up, you know. It just takes insane persistence, always being ready um, ahead of time for when that role comes. So, you know, training and, and knowing your martial arts and things like that helps, obviously. Um, staying in shape and then just, just never giving up and being nice to people. That's what I figured out. When you're nice to people and they want to work with you, it helps a lot. <laughs> So nice getting to chat with you. Yeah. I'm excited to see you on screen again. Well, thank you. Yeah, definitely. And we got to see Frozen. I have to see Frozen too. Well, this month at the El Capitan Theater, they're having um, a Frozen. They're playing the show, but it's a sing along. So uh, oh, you really? can go sing. Yeah, I know. I want to oh go. Gosh, your daughter's going to be all over that. Yeah, she, is. she is. Yeah, no, I've heard it's like the film of the year. It's, so. it's pretty amazing. Yeah, what I've seen so far. I'm excited. Well, thank you so much, yeah. Christian. Thank have you. a great have a good day. Valentine's Day. Yeah, you too. Thanks for watching the Red Carpet Report, guys. We hope you had a great Valentine's. Let us know who's on your Oscar list this year. Like the video, subscribe, and we'll see you later.